What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Rob and Alex here, ready to react to Stranger Things Season 3, Episode Number 2. In the last episode, we saw that it's been one full year since the previous events in Season 2. Uh, the Soviet Union now is apparently trying to open the gate to try and open the Upside Down. No it's idea why. Idea. Yeah, no idea why they'd want to do that. It's just things that government agencies try to do, I guess. <laughs> Uh, we met up with the kids again. Max and Lucas are now dating. Mike and Eleven are together as well, which is, you know, pretty obvious. Yeah. Although, uh, uh Mike's being a bit of a little shit about it. Yeah, I was gonna say, Hopper, however, isn't really too thrilled. Uh, to say the least. <laughs> um, Nancy and Jonathan are both interning at a, the local paper. Nancy is not really fitting in as well, probably because she's literally, like, getting coffee, doing all the, you know, little stuff for the little big heads there, while Jonathan is actually just, like, doing photographs, which isn't bad. Yeah. That's, you can see that's his passion, but he's not really dealing with all that. Well, I mean, I'd also, I mean, you got to look at the times. Like, is it really surprising? Yeah, that's that too. Billy is still trying to get with uh, Mike's fine milf of a mom. <laughs> Can't really I blame mean, him. He almost had it, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, she's not against it. They actually plan to uh, have some swimming lessons later that night, right? I mean, she was certainly going to be wet. Yeah. I think I made that joke last time. I don't remember. But they made plans to get together. And as she was leaving, she saw her husband and her daughter laying on the recliner, I think. And probably had some th second thoughts. Didn't really get that far. We kind of just bumped, uh, jumped over to Billy after that. Yeah, we don't even know if she had second thoughts. It's possible she's still on her way there. Yeah, it's possible. She looked at him and was just like, ugh, <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> uh, Dustin had come back from his summer camp. And he told everyone he had a girlfriend. He was really excited. And he he tried to go and get in contact with her up on this hill with his new, like, satellite radio thing. I don't even, I forgot what they called it. But when he wasn't getting through to her, it was pretty fucked up. They were all just calling him a liar, saying she doesn't exist. You know, it's not cool. You guys are fucking happy and shit. Like, let him have this. Even if it is made up, let him fucking have it, right? Uh, he actually ended up getting through to the Soviets, it sounded like. Yeah, weird how he was able to reach that far. Yeah. Um, but like, let's let's be honest. Uh, is she real? I don't know. <laughs> I, I couldn't <laughs> tell you. I'm defending Dustin, but I mean, come on. <laughs> I can't tell you. Uh, Billy, on his way to the meeting with the MILF, he got into an accident because something jumped in the front of his car, and. It looks like he is now being captured by what we are assuming to be the shadow monster. And he is most likely going to be his next host. I mean, if I didn't want him dead before. <laughs> like, yeah, it's uh, pretty fucked up. Like, oh, what about Steve? Oh, Steve, he's uh, working at the, what was it? Like the yogurt? Was it yogurt or ice cream? Or? It's one of those. I, I want to say ice cream. Yeah, some shop. And he's got this co-worker, this girl, kind of getting along. And he's not really having any luck with the women. He has to wear that hat. Yeah, it, it's, it's covering up his best feature, right? Yeah. So that's got to suck. But the last thing we got to make mention of is that um, Will is starting to get those tingles again. You know, I know you said that you, you wish... He'd kind of get a break, but doesn't that seem poor, that way. That poor, poor bastard, man. Yeah, it's unfortunate, but he's getting, he's getting the feels. Not those kind of feels, but you know what I mean. Uh, anyway, that was a little recap. So let's just jump right in. Season three, episode number two. <laughs> Holy oh, shit! shit. <laughs> Damn, I think beat the shit out of him. Nine one one, what's your emergency? 
Oh shit. Wait. He's in the upside down, huh? Oh, shit. Or at least like mentally he is. Like how how Will used to. Yeah, what the hell? Why are you walking towards them? The fuck? Where did Hopper take Mike? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, this is the Wheelers. Yeah, just a sec. Mike! Phone! Can't see you today. Wh why not? It's my Nana. But your Nana was okay that it was a false alarm. <laughs> <laughs> we think she might die. What? What the hell? <laughs> 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 so what's the new excuse <laughs> I need to be alone today with my feelings do you lie oh shit <laughs> my mom's calling me better go talk to you tomorrow miss you already bye what did Hopper tell him they cut his balls off <laughs> you <laughs> I'm on Hopper's side, man. Mike was being a little shit. <laughs> He's so damn happy. <laughs> Emotions have been shared. Boundaries have been set. Are you going to tell her what you did? <laughs> <laughs> they will not be seeing each other. Yes, I think it worked. Yes. You're lying to her. <laughs> I'll tell you everything over dinner. I was thinking, you know, Enzo's tonight, 7 o'clock. Hey, before you say no, I'd, I'd like to make one thing crystal clear. This is not a date. I just wanted to clear it up in case there was any confusion on your part. You're so odd. <laughs> you want to keep your job tomorrow? I think you need to get your ass to town hall. Now! What's going on there? What the hell's going on? Magnets aren't working. That's strange. If I'm her, if I'm her, I'm thinking, what the fuck now? Yeah. Oh shit! shit. Oopsie daisy. <laughs> Not everything needs your commentary, douche. I've been having some girl problems. <laughs> 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 such an easy out look all i'm saying is what harm is there in asking the harm in asking is that tom will say no we ask for forgiveness not permission that's true sometimes that is the right way to go not all the time no i'm dustin i'm robin pleasure to meet you uh, is, is she here is who here henderson <laughs> He's back. He's back. Okay, she's like, what the fuck is this? Oh. <laughs> Bruh, what happened to you, Steve? <laughs> Major dork. There's that beautiful hair. <laughs> she says kissing is better without teeth. Wow, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's not a really good idea for me, though. You know, I gotta keep in shape for the ladies. Yeah, and how's that working out for you? Ignore her. <laughs> uh, I'm sure it'll be working out just fine by the end of the season. Probably. My intersecting super potions for communication. What? Communication. Just speak louder. I intercepted a secret Russian communication. Jeez. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought she said. <laughs> Too loud, <What>? man. <laughs> Could be heroes. True American heroes. This is in the midst of the Cold War, right? So. Hi. Hi. Okay. And then he just hung up. He's a piece of shit. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Friends don't lie. Yeah, well, boyfriends lie. All the time. 
She knows yeah. I'm lying. She knows I'm <laughs> lying. I don't even understand. <laughs> What's the big deal? The big deal is, is if I don't do what he says, then he'll stop me from seeing out. Like, permanently. He's crazy. He's lost his mind. Hey, guys. Um, no. He was justifiably irritated with you being a piece of shit. <laughs> he treated you like garbage. You're gonna treat him like garbage. Give him a taste of his own medicine. You better explain all these terms to her, because... <laughs> <laughs> it's just one little mistake. I've made hundreds, thousands. Max has dumped me five times. Jeez. Bruh. And I've won her back every single freaking time. I don't know, man. It sounds like there's more issues with you. <laughs> there's more to life than stupid boys, you know. They're gonna run into each other. Guys, I'm still here. <laughs> Poor Will. <laughs> hey, Jill, I gotta use the restroom. Will you watch Holly for me? Sure thing, hi. Thanks. He's gonna, like, blow her off, isn't he? Maybe. It's interesting, because this is the first time that she, her character is kind of getting, like, more story. Not you. It's just... You can understand that, right? But I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> oh, what shit. the fuck? Billy. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, what the hell? Stay away from me, Karen. It's probably for the best. <laughs> <sighs> he is dealing with some shit now. Yeah. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to feel bad for him, though. Me either. I don't know if I do. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure I don't. I'm just. Why do you other ladies even try? Clearly, the only one that has a chance is Mike's mom. Mm. Can I try the peppermint stick? Fuck you, kid. He has no idea what the fuck it's saying. What? The music. The music right there at the end. <laughs> hey, my lord! That was important data, shit birds. I guarantee you what we're doing is way more important than your data. Yeah. Yeah. And how do you know these Russians are up to no good anyways? How does she know? You yelled the information, dude. I can hear everything. You are both extremely loud. <laughs> I'm fluent in four languages, you know. Russian? Uye arye umbade. They don't even know you what that don't is. don't even that know. <laughs> what you believe to do, Steve? Nancy Wheeler, we spoke briefly on the phone last night. We're from the Harkins Post. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, my goodness. You look too young for reporters. But something's not right with these rats. What does that mean exactly? Oh, yes, I forgot to mention. Come on over. <laughs> what? <laughs> She caught one? Doesn't sound like a rat. Mm -mm. So, what do you think? Oh, they're at the mall. Against the rules. Seriously? You have superpowers. What's the worst that could happen? That's part of the reason for the yeah. rules. <laughs> You've never been shopping before, have you? Well, then I guess we're just gonna. I mean, she lived in captivity for the first, like, 10 years of her life. Yeah. And a hopper held her in captivity for another year. <laughs> I mean, that was a totally different situation. I know, though. I'm just saying. It was a joke, Alex. Something <laughs> pretty and shiny that says I'm sorry. What's well, something that literally says I'm sorry? So you you just buy her shit? Or... Do you like that? How do I know? What? <laughs> you just try things on until you find something that feels like you. It is cool seeing her get to do, like, normal stuff. Yeah. But you can only imagine it's going to go horribly wrong at some point. Yeah. Who's this? 
I don't know. Oh, is that the teacher? Just big and angry. Do you mind if I make just a few more calls? Not at all. I enjoy the company. I thought you liked the quiet. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, little bud. It's mutating. Back up. Back up. I have a lead. Uh, yeah, okay, but uh, I just think there's something really wrong with this rap. Yeah, no shit. Oh. Oh, God, I saw that coming. Thanks a lot, Nancy. This is why you're stuck on coffee duty. <laughs> <laughs> that is disgusting. What do you want? To build. I want you to build. Go get some Legos. <laughs> Shove that little teddy bear right up his. <laughs> no. Yeah. Walk away, walk boys. Away, guys. You're too young for this. Is that the girl yeah, that refused to dance with Dustin? <laughs> Can we please play D and D now? No. You gotta feel bad for Will. He just wants to live yeah. a regular, fun life. He missed out the last two years. Thanks. Wait a second. Are you even allowed to be here? <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I just mow oh, you've man gotta be want. shitting me. Yeah, but build up that much okay, what if we split it? You know she's not allowed to be here. What is she, your little pet? Yeah. Am I your pet? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's sick. sick. She's sick. She's super sick. Bro, don't jump. Don't jump in. I couldn't find anything that suited you, and I only have like three dollars and fifty cents, so it's hard. Super hard. <laughs> <laughs> three dollars, dude. Uh oh. I dump your ass. Oh shit. You shouldn't be using that as a weapon, though. <laughs> you then love cherries, huh? All right, we'll have uh, that uh, two two glasses, please. One for uh, me and one for the lady. Mm, very good, sir. If she even shows up, which I don't think she will. Yeah. Core, and when electricity passes through it, it creates an electromagnetic field. Exact to move that. It's there, I assure you. Our very own Clark Byers electromagnetic field. Pretty neato, huh? It's weird how this dude doesn't know any of the shit that's been going on. I know. Although he's played like a small role in a lot of it. And very helpful, too. Yeah. The, the silver, silver cat, cat feeds when blue meets yellow in the west. The west. Hi, Steve. Hey, Steve. What? What are you doing? Uh, it's quarter. Do you, I need, do you have a quarter? Holy shit. This code, it didn't come from Russia. It came from here. So wait, are they at the facility then? The same huh. facility? I'd like to order your entree, sir. You know what? Enzo. My name is not Enzo. <laughs> Do anything I want. I'm the chief of police. Ooh, that's not a good attitude to have. Yeah, it was a horrible to have. Oh. Don't be afraid. I'll be on our side. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh.
right, that was episode number two of Stranger Things. So much happened in this episode. Uh, first off, I want to say... <laughs> so, because I know he's, like, possessed, okay? But by the end of the season, he has to go to prison, right? <laughs> I mean, he's <laughs> abducting people, feeding them monsters, killing them, essentially. Well, for, well, I don't want to... We, we have no idea if he's going to die, but... No, um... And what I was going to say, because one of the things we saw in his vision was, like, when he was talking to, like, himself or whatever, was they said that they wanted him to build it. Yeah. And when he, uh, when he asked what, they said, what you see. And I'm guessing, because what he saw was, a bunch like, of a bunch of people... So I'm guessing they meant like an army or something. Maybe. That might be so what I think, it is. So I don't think he's killing anyone. I think he's taking more people to be infected. It's possible. That actually kind of makes sense. Um, Hopper seemed to have gotten to Mike a little bit. Very scared. Uh, him and Eleven seemingly are done for now uh, i can't tell she, if it's a joke his ass, or, right? I, well you can't tell if she's just messing with him to kind of get back at him or if she's serious either way well, that, i mean uh fuck why am i blanking on, on the redhead's name all of a sudden max max yeah um matt what like we know that max has broken up with lucas multiple times like it's almost like she's using the breakup as like a weapon of sorts to to punish him. Yeah. Uh, and it's like if that's what they're doing, that's pretty fun. Um, yeah. It is. <laughs> so yeah. I'm sure I'm sure they'll end up getting back together relatively soon. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, hey, at least Max has a friend that she can go and hang out with and do stuff with. Yeah. Even if she's breaking a bunch of rules. <laughs> Will, I'm starting to feel bad for because throughout the series, he's just been kidnapped and taken and infected with the, the shadow monster, taken to the upside down, almost died. And he just wants to live his childhood now, have yeah, a normal childhood. He wanted to play some D and D. He just wanted to relax and have like hang out with his friends. Is that too much to ask for one yeah. day? To just hang out with the boys. For real, and he can't because they're over here worrying about girlfriend stuff, which he'll probably one of them end wasn't up... even there. Yeah, just unfortunate. Uh, Dustin meets Robin and Steve over at the ice cream shop, and they're over there cracking a code from the Russians, and uh, they seem to have cracked it, but it's still. You know, they need to figure out the meaning because it's all, even though it was in Russian, the English version is clearly a code that they have to try to unravel. And they figured out that the music possibly came from there, but you, I don't think that that song is... I mean, obviously the show is going to take us in that direction where it, they were in that spot, but I mean, there's more than one of those, right? <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I don't know. We'll, we'll find out at some point, obviously, but... It just seemed a little weird. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out what else. Like I said earlier, that MILF, she... This is the um, the most she's been, like, involved in, in the show. Like, a, like her own little story. Like, it's not yeah, but we lot, want, we, how much How much more of it are we going to see, though? Like, he did, he did tell her to stay away from him. So, unless she's going to start actively pursuing him, which would be pretty fucked up. Well, uh, I think... He's going to actively pursue her now because he needs to get that army built, right? Maybe. Maybe. Um, I was going to say something, but I'm forgetting it all of a sudden. I was thinking when Nancy and Jonathan were over doing their journalism stuff, I was like, they seem more like they'd be better at like PI stuff because of the last two seasons more so than the journalist stuff unless this is like just a start for them but when they were doing that i don't know i mean who knows maybe but at the same time like 
Jonathan really just wants to focus on taking photos. That's always that's sort of always been his passion. Yeah. Whereas Nancy, like just based on the times that they're in, I can't imagine would ha- ever be able to get into being a PI or being or being taken taken seriously as one. Yeah. And it's unfortunate that right when she went and told Jonathan that she had her lead from upstairs, that's when the rat wanted to burst open and explode into whatever the hell that thing was. Yeah, man, and it's out of the cage now, so they're never going to see it again, and who knows what's going to happen to the old lady. Oh yeah, she's definitely dead. <laughs> There's no question about that. Uh, is there anything else? Poor Hopper. Hopper thought he was going to have a date, even though he says it wasn't a date, let's face it. He's dressed up, he's getting all wine and dine, getting liquor, and alcohol, getting all ready. He's all dressed up. He wanted a date. Uh, but um, Joyce was over there at the house of his of her son's teacher, who's huge into science and stuff. Which you made a good point. Why isn't he more involved, like with all this stuff? Like, and it's not not just like why isn't he more involved, but how does he not know any of it? Yeah, like he's completely kept in the dark about everything regarding uh, the the Department of Energy stuff that they were dealing with the last two seasons. But, like, they've sort of relied on him yeah. for, like, help in uh, some of these scenarios. Mm-hmm. So why, why, at what point is he going to be clued in, if ever? No idea. But they were figuring out the magnetic for, uh, field or whatever because her house and her store, her little department store, they're both, like, the magnets aren't staying on, right? That. Yeah. So that's strange. That obviously, that does that have something to do with the upside down and how it's spreading underneath the town, or how I, I don't know. Uh, who knows? I mean, you, it might just have something to do with uh, whatever's happening at the the Department of Energy facility, uh, the lab, or whatever. And that's like another when, that's another thing to question. Are they in the Soviet Union? Or is it there in town? Because if they're just there, like, is it the same building? I thought that they were over in Russia. Yeah, I thought so too. I don't know though. I don't remember if it said where they were. Or if we just assumed because they were speaking Russian. In the flag. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it's a lot of questions going to be an interesting season i dig it i do like that the kids are doing more and you're starting to see like the like i thought it was cool like the mall that little montage of 11 and max hanging out getting that 80s vibe i think that's pretty cool but i don't think there's anything else that i wanted to touch on you got anything else no I don't know. all right hopefully you guys enjoyed our reactions if you haven't already please hit that like button Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Leave a comment down below without leaving any spoilers, please. And if you're interested in anime reactions, down in the description is a link to Alex's YouTube channel. And with all that big said, we will see you guys in the next one.